So first I'm gonna take this heart and it has, it's a sticker. So I'm gonna take this off. Let's see. Okay, so you peel that off and then place it where you want it to go. So I'm just gonna put it in the middle of my canvas. Make sure it's down nicely. Okay. So then we can start painting around the heart. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my brush and then take some water and just wet these paints a little so it's easier to pick up with the Q-tip. So I'm gonna use red and orange and yellow because um, it's a heart and we're doing this for Valentine's Day. So I'm gonna use those colors, but you can use whatever colors you want. Okay, so I'm gonna start with red and I'm gonna just dab my Q-tip in there and just create dots around the thing. So I'm gonna start with with dots that are closer together and then as we go we can move out and then don't be afraid to go over the heart because that will peel off later I'm gonna add more water Stay close to the heart because then I'll go in with a different color and spread it out more. Just more water so I can pick up more paint. Just gonna keep on going all the way around. Keep this up. Sometimes it's a little hard to get the color, so just press harder on the pad. gonna go all the way around the heart about halfway there right now a little over and I'm doing some outside this more closer part because then I'll put another color and that way it'll look like it's blending into the other color more water Just keep the dots closer together as you get closer to the heart. And it's okay to keep it on the heart too. So that'll peel off later. Just dabbing. Okay, so that's my red done. And I think I might just go over it a little just in some places where it doesn't really show. So right here I'll do one and 
just make it a little darker. I might go over that later. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in with my next color. And that's going to be orange. So I'm gonna take just the other side of the Q-tip and then I will just move on to my next color. And that's orange, so wetting the orange. And the same thing, just the dots. And what I'm going to do is as I move out from the heart, I'm just gonna space the dots a little further apart. So that way it looks like it's sort of blending together. And I'm just gonna take the orange dots further out than these far red ones I have here. Just the next layer. And use whatever colors. I'm just using orange today. Wetting that, taking it in a little. And if your Q-tip starts to string a little and then you don't get that dot anymore, you can always use the next one. But I'm just gonna keep using this one for right now. Just wet it. A little farther out. that out just more water Take that a little further out. Okay, so that's the orange layer done, and then you see we get this sort of nice blending effect. And what I'm gonna do afterwards is go in with another color, but you can stop here or keep on going. It just depends on what you want to do. Um, I think I'll do a small yellow layer just on the edges of the heart. And I'll just go in with another Q-tip and just a few dots on the outside. Can't just a few dots real quick and pressing down on the pad to get the color. And there you go. 
I did the three colors, red, orange, and yellow. And when you're done and satisfied with how your colors look, all we're gonna do is I'm just gonna pick it up and this find the edge of the heart. And peel it off. There you go.